This video is for you cruise lovers and for those of you who are animal lovers. My wife and I recently had an experience that was a lot of fun. I'm Jeff. Thanks for watching today. On our last cruise to the Eastern Caribbean, we decided to go whale watching in St. Lucia. Now, we really wanted to do that in Dominica, but the excursion sold out before we had a chance to get our tickets. So our fallback choice was St. Lucia. We got up early and met our group on the pier. Then we walked about a block to our tour boat and the crew welcomed us on board. Once we all got our safety briefings and were told what to look for, we headed out to sea to see what we could find. By the way, this is a view of our ship from the tour boat. This shows you just how close we were. It wasn't much of a walk at all. The captain throttled up to get us to the best whale viewing area as quickly as possible, and that made for a windy and bumpy ride. Once we slowed down a bit, we were offered a snack and a variety of drinks, and I took the rum punch, but my wife opted for something a bit milder because she didn't trust what a mixture of rum punch and a rough ride might do to her. Well, after about an hour of scanning the horizon, looking for spouts, tails, or any other sign that whales were around, we came to the sad realization that nobody told the whales that this was the best place to view them. But then we soon discovered that we weren't alone out there. First, it was just one or two dolphins that were checking us out. And as you can see, they moved so fast, it was really hard to keep my camera on them. But then word got around and a huge pod of dolphins showed up and started putting on a show for us and a handful of other boats that were in the area. As you're watching these guys playing around, I'd like to ask you to please give this video a like, give it a thumbs up, and then consider subscribing to the Backroads Tourist Channel. Every week I bring you several videos on cruise news and reviews, as well as tips and tricks. I also put up videos about my visits to quirky, wonderful places, and I think you might get a kick out of those videos too. So thank you for liking and thank you for subscribing. I do appreciate it. After a while, it was time to head on back. The scenic cruise was still a bit windy and rough. In fact, one of our fellow cruisers lost their hat overboard, and fortunately, nobody lost anything else overboard, if you know what I mean, and I think you do. The crew kept us entertained with drinks, snacks, island music, and even a little dancing. Before too long, we were back in the harbor and passing the Enchanted Princess once again. We still had some time to kill, so we walked around the port area and did a little bit of shopping. We were both happy to see that the vendors weren't pushy at all. Now, we've run into that in several ports, mostly in the Western Caribbean, and it's refreshing to be able to walk around without being hassled by aggressive vendors. So at the end of the day, we didn't see any whales, but we did see a ton of dolphins and we had a lot of fun. So we were happy with the excursion. Hey, thanks again for watching today. Please remember to like and subscribe. I'm Jeff, and I hope to meet you on a future cruise.